hey guys welcome back to my channel today i'm washing my hair and right here i'm making a pre-poo with olive oil moringa oil and castor oil this is just to protect my hair so that the shampoo is not too harsh on it and i can still feel the moisture and it's not completely stripped here i have some rice water okay guys as you can see my hair is looking very disgusting i had nutless braids in for a month and a week and a half and i know people can go three months but for me it's a big milestone two weeks would be the maximum for me so i'm really proud of myself and my hair grew a lot but here it is looking disgusting it is looking dirty matted it's knotted and i'm sure it doesn't smell nice so here i'm just adding on the pre pour oil i made earlier and i'm about to go wash my hair in the next clip the pre pour has been in for about 30 to 45 minutes and now i am going to put the shampoo on my hair i'm using the masodi um african black soap so i wet my hair with hot water because i have low porosity hair and hot water helps me open up my follicles i use a t-shirt to dry my hair because towels you know the huge so here i'm washing my hair i'm focusing a lot on my scalp but i also want to wash my strands because i had a lot of product in them i was moisturizing the uh, or the whole strand of my hair in the braids so yeah here i went in for the second time um okay i'm trying to get a thumbnail here <laughs> Yeah, so I went in for the second time just to make sure it's clean. And here I'm using my Tangle Teaser to just rub my scalp and get the excess dirt off. And yeah, here I'm just literally playing with my hair, <laughs> trying to get another thumbnail. So please don't mind that. Yeah, so here I'm going to wash my hair. Then I'm going to dry it with a towel. My hair is looking clean and fresh. My scalp is breathing. You know, my hair follicles. My hair feels like hair again and I've honestly missed my natural hair. Now I'm putting on a deep conditioner. It's a deep conditioner and a hair mask at the same time. So just enjoy this clip of me putting on a deep conditioner. And my hairline, the pits. Yeah. There is still so much left. And I'm just gonna put full protein. Ah. small piece though like it wasn't that much fresh under there can we just talk about how dirty i look <sighs> like i got some on me here and, you know this like big chunk here but that's okay i used the aloe vera one fresh banana it was supposed to be right but i don't listen 
banana, um, some honey, uh, castor oil, and olive oil, extra virgin olive oil. Yeah, I think that's it. Yeah, I think that's it, if I'm not mistaken. I'm going to keep this on for like 30 minutes. And then, you guys, please don't mind the background noises. And then I'm going to wash it out in the shower. So I can't film that. So I'll see you guys when I'm going to moisturize my hair. And yeah, we'll talk later. So yeah. You know, whatever. Deep conditioning or whatever. Uh, soft care Sunday or whatever. Look at my hair. This is my hair. All my days. All my days. Like, guys, look at the clothes that I got. Like. <laughs> <laughs> the day my hair grows is over for you over okay guys i just came from the shower and i washed my hair and i bathed myself you know i'm clean okay so now i'm going to moisturize my hair and i like to sometimes use the lock method sometimes i use the lco method and i think i want to use the lco method because i think i prefer it more because at the end i get to use the oil and it seals everything in so yeah i like using that but if all else fails then ah we'll see nah nah i just put to be honest like i'm not i just put like i don't have a stun black so yeah but the products i'm gonna be using most of them are gonna be from masodi uh and i filmed like a video of my reaction of using their products but eh, i don't like the way i filmed it so i might edit it i might not we'll see but for now but i like their products you know so this is the leave-in conditioner it's made from coconut oil and robust tea and it contains vitamin e and then i have their castor oil the ingredients are pure castor oil and then here i have the moringa oil like it's the container of the moringa oil is glass so obviously being me i broke it so I just put it in this little container. And then here I just have hot water just in case my hair gets dry. I have low porosity hair so I needed to open up my hair bulk. Right. And then here is just like a leave another leave-in conditioner. This one is by Cantu but I put it in this Afrobotanics um, thingy thing. <clears throat> and then I have this 100% uh, pure unrefined shea butter and then i have the masodi's shea butter this one has um shea butter coconut oil castor oil olive oil vitamin e oil and essential oils all right okay and then here these are my detangling tools i'm going to use this to part my hair and then here we'll see and then here the tangle teaser to detangle my hair now i want to use a white tooth comb but my hair like isn't long enough and i don't want to like you know and i don't want to use it today because my hair is really tangled so i'm gonna take my time with it and finger detangle and stuff like that and use the tangle teaser but that's and then I'm going to put it in mini twists and then that's what I'm going to do for the week. Yeah, I'm going to be re-moisturizing it every time I remember or every time I have energy too. 
so yeah let us get into the moisturization Uh, I just wanted to give you guys a quick word of advice that um, I'm sure you've been seeing me playing through my hair throughout this whole process. So I learned from one of my favorite natural hair YouTubers that um, don't just detangle your hair when you're done like or when, or when you have the deep conditioner in. Do it throughout the whole process so that by the time you're using a comb or a brush, it's not that tangled and, you know, it's easier and also i'm doing a lot of finger detangling in each and every step even as i'm moisturizing i'm trying to finger detangle my hair throughout In this clip, okay, let me just explain. <laughs> I'm watching a movie called Joyful Noise. I highly recommend it. It's a Christian movie. So I was watching that movie and, you know, like towards the end, there's like a choir competition. So I know the song and I was sinning to it. So <laughs> don't mind me <laughs> acting all weird. <laughs> Okay, now we're starting with the part that I feel like I dread the most and we get to the detangling section. Now my hair is all moisturized and I'm loving it. Now I'm just using that dread tooth comb to section my hair off so I can put it in twists. Guys, on Google, the recipe said strain the deep conditioner. Ne? Did I listen? Of course not. Now, there are banana pieces in my hair, and you'll see that throughout the video. So, if you're wondering what that is, it's the banana. And, guys, at this point, I was tired. I was, you know, over it, but I had to detangle and style my hair because I didn't want it to dry out. Here, I am still doing nice, nice. It actually got in the middle towards the end. I didn't film that, but I was just ripping through my hair and I pray that I didn't get a lot of breakage. But then I was just putting, I was detangling my hair 
throughout my whole head and then putting it in twists so that it stays moisturized. So oh guys, I'm finally done after like two hours and I'm actually really proud of myself because like most of the times when I do my hair or try and put it in mini twists, I usually give up by like my hair's like this or at the beginning or like when I'm feeling tired but by the grace of God, I finished and I tried making them a little bit like thick because your hair is king. But I'm done. So yeah, let me just show you guys. This is how it's looking. Like now, the schools are closed for like a week. So for the week, my hair's gonna be like this. Then I'm gonna wash it again and then put it in the damn day tea. Um, yeah, guys. So this is how it's looking in the front. It's looking pretty moisturized. We we'll love to see it. This is how it's looking at the back. You know, this is how we are doing it. So this is me for the week. Yes, let me just turn it out. So yeah, guys, thank you guys so much for watching the video, and I hope you guys enjoyed. And um, tell me what type of like hit content you wanna see. If you wanna like, if you want me to do challenges and stuff like that, tell me. Um, and comment down below, like what your hair like what you did with your hair is it an afro is it relaxed dreadlocks um yeah and hey guys not my hair <laughs> if you want to understand just go like my second video or something watch it you'll understand and i'm very indecisive with my hair but i think this is the final stop you know i think i'm gonna do an afro and then that's it like <laughs> You know so yeah thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys enjoy the video and please like share comment and subscribe share with your friends turn your post notifications so that you don't miss out on another video thank you guys for watching god bless